This is Mary from Mary's Stamping Happenings, and this is There's a Card Thursday. I hope you really enjoy this video and cards, and if you'd like to purchase any of the products seen, you can go to my website at marytroutner.stampinup.net and click on Shop Now. Hi, this is Mary from Mary's Stamping Happenings, and today is There's a Card Thursday. And we're going to do a quick, um, kind of interesting Christmas card. Let me get this in focus. Um, I'm using Best Gifts that's in the, or in the holiday catalog. Um, and uh, we're going to be doing, let's put this down. We're going to be doing um, this quick card. So, first thing we're going to be using is the best gifts, of course. Um, for ink, uh, we're going to be using um, chocolate chip and Wisteria Wonder, plus um, some markers. Okay. Uh, for card stock, uh, we're going to be using an 8.5 by 5.5 piece of Wisteria Wonder. Uh, let's bring this up just a little bit. And we're going to be folding that, and this is going to be our card base, okay? And then we're using some Whisper White. I've already cut this out uh, from the um, uh, Big Shot. I've used the oval circle punches, or the circle layered circle punches, and the largest, or one of the largest scallops. And then we have a four and a half, or four and a quarter by one inch piece, very vanilla. Um, what else we're going to be using is... I've used the foil snowflakes that are in the um, holiday catalog, and I cut them in half. We're also going to be using, of course, our Stampin' Dimensionals and glue dots, a big shot, and then, as I said before, um, the layering circle framelits and <clears throat> the banner triple punches we're going to be using also, okay? So, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take this and we're going to ink up the uh, uh, Christmas tree scene with uh, chocolate chip. Now, you can do this and then cut it out how you want it later. Um, I just find it easier so I don't have to go back and forth to the Big Shot to do it first. Um, so, and then I'm just going to lay that on there. Mary is wonderful, Mary is wonderful, Mary is wonderful. And we've got something like this. Now what we're going to do is we're going to color this in. I'm going to use real red and I'm going to use the um, small and, and go over the Merry Christmas. And my eyesight is getting worse and worse. I would have normally not done that. Maybe I should have used the bl Stampin' Blends here so I could erase some of this. You know with the Stampin' Blends or alcohol markers you can erase mistakes. Not huge mistakes I don't think but I'm hoping a little mistakes like this. Anyhow we're just going to highlight a few things on this picture because we don't want to color everything in, but we do want to color some of the stuff in. And the reason you want to just highlight it is so their eyes go to it. And let's do a couple of the packages, maybe the tree. Taking out pear pizzazz, and I'll do the tree. So saffron, and do the little star. Let's do And 
this is a non-traditional colored tr Christmas card. Even though some purples are tradition, um, most aren't. They have the rocking horse and the bear and this also as separate stamps. So that's all I'm going to do with that one. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and, uh, oh, forgot this one. I'm going to stamp the saying on, and then you want to stamp the saying right in the middle of this. And then you're going to take your banner triple punch and make tails. There you go. Okay. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take some glue dots on the back of the sayings. And you're just going to glue that on All right like that and then you're going to take some just like that and we all know the trick put a little mark in there with your fingernails they pop up get that white stuff off put that up on top and this on the bottom. Let's get this. For There's Card Thursday, thanks for visiting and happy stamping. Oh yeah, don't forget to, to follow me on uh, YouTube and all the, inst uh, all the uh, ingredients and supplies for the card are down below. Please buy from me. I really would appreciate it. Thanks. Have a good day. Bye-bye.